So here's my IBM Think Center. And as you can see, I took down my fan. And as you can see, I never thought that my computer will get so dirty after eight months. I vacuum my room every weekend. So <laughs> look at that. Yucky. So for actually, I don't know. And if it's my subscriber Shadow four 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 two 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 YouTube user, ask it me. Actually, he comment on my YouTube video. My main computer overheating problem solved. And yes, CPU got stuck to the heatsink. That actually happened to me too. Um, when I got that think center, actually, now I didn't change that thermal grease on it, so it was original thermal grease on that heatsink, and I will remove that one now, if I can do it. Yeah, need to change it again, look at that. So my CPU didn't got stuck now to the heatsink, but I hope, actually I got it down pretty nicely. There are no marks of removing it. So, the CPU looks something like that. You even didn't need it to remove that thingy over here. Um, actually, the CPU just got out. And actually, you pulled that CPU out. The CPU now looks something like that. So now let's go down here. How to remove that CPU? Or actually, how did I remove? I use that flat bit screwdriver, put it over here, and just gently try to remove a little bit on that side, that side, that, and on that, and just do every time, actually repeat that process. So, now I need to get my camera down on the tripod. How it looks. Don't get your screwdriver under that CPU. It needs to get over here. And actually that also works for Doro 775, Intel Core 2 Duo, and Intel Pentium and other things. Do it like that. Up here. And gently. Do not turn it. Just put it up. Do not turn it, you will bro broke your CPU. So that's how you remove your CPU from the heatsink. And now I need to change that thermal grease. As you can see, there's no more thermal compound on it. Need to clean that CPU and also that black thing, black thermal paste, which is originally in here and just be gentle with it and it will go just perfect so i hope i solved your problem